Right, I'm going to show you how you can leverage AI and specific ChatGPT and a couple other tools to build backlinks for free. 100% for free. And as you can see here, this is uh, the growth of our backlink profile. As you can see, it goes straight up. That's the number of referring domains. The number of backlinks is quite higher because oftentimes, of course, people, um, one domain can have multiple backlinks, right? So as you see here, right here, the uh, number of backlinks is almost 2,000 and the referring domain is under 60, meaning that, of course, from one domain, there's multiple ba multiple backlinks being built, right? And the backlinks are good, right? I mean, we've just started, but as you can see here, we have quite a few ones with uh, high, high, high DRs from 80 to 90. And I want to show you exactly how you can do it in specific for uh, this niche that we're in. Uh, not AI, because this is an AI tool, but in specific for software and tools, right? And the best way to do, the, to do this and to acquire these backlinks is through review articles and uh, listicles, okay? So let me just show you here um, a couple of the things I mean right here. So first things first is review articles, right? Um, all this, going right here, right? It's written by other people, right? And they link out to our tool, right? right? These are individual articles, uh, written by other people, right? This video article with a review on our tool, right? On our software, right? And of course, because we offer an affiliate program, these people make money. And so these people have the incentive to write all these long form articles, right? Going over what the tool is, why it's good, why it's not good, right? The good, the bad, the ugly, right? All these, you can, this one right here was written by a guy named Connor Martin, which is an affiliate for our tool, right? They all have the in incentive, right? To write proper in-depth article with uh, their own opinions, right? What they like, what they don't, li don't like, including screenshots, maybe even including video, right? All this very, very in depth, right? With pricing and a bunch of stuff, and even comparing other tools, right? And so this is the whole goal, right? With review based uh, backlink. And the way in which you can generate review based backlinks, which is most of what's here, right? We also have a bunch of them that are not review based, but they are listicle based, so for example, top 10 A writing tools, right? And all these guys right here, big, big companies like SEMrush, ClickUp, right? If you click this right here, right? These guys have articles in which they go down and go in depth on all of these tools, like a top 10 listing. And all of these, as you can see here, right, are all, mostly these should be all affiliate links. Uh, yeah, affiliate link right here, right? So all these guys, what they're doing here is leveraging their brand, right, to build up these listicle articles, again, top 10 type of listicle articles, to um, make affiliate commissions and, of course, rank their blog, right? And again, that's the two top ways to build links free if you have a, a software or a kind of a tool it's one right here again i got this here right here the way you can get free backlinks is essentially one is with review articles so incentivizing people to write long form articles reviewing your product or service right and this way you get links to your website right again the way in which you incentivize people to write review articles if you, is if you have an aggressive affiliate program right if you're compensating people with commissions in our case it's 30 percent recurring for life right if you're giving them such a good 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 deal right such a great deal right most likely if they're affiliate marketers or they're content marketers they're going to make sure that they rank first for their for your tool for slash review or uh, pros and cons or uh, for example um competitors or alternatives right and again you can play around with this right Alternative review, for example, right? They're going to they're going to make sure that they rank for all these keywords. Even people are on LinkedIn, right? They syndicate their articles to LinkedIn, to because LinkedIn has higher domain rating, to get them ranked even higher. And again, all these should have affiliate links, as you can see here. This is an affiliate link, as you can see down below, in the bottom left corner, uh, it has via equals Connor. It's his affiliate link. Again, the way which in which you incentivize this to happen is to have an aggressive, aggressive affiliate uh, affiliate uh, program. And if you have a tool, right, most likely you are gonna have an affiliate program. If you don't have one, it's one of the best ways to build backlinks is to offer people something in return for them, for them to produce content for you. And this is great for two reasons. First, again, just talking about the, uh, not the listicles yet, but just talking about review articles is good first because you get backlinks like the ones you see here, right? We've been able to grow our DR and UR based on these backlinks, right? We're growing in terms of backlinks, right? Or referring domains at least, as you can see here. Uh, so your domain gets more powerful because you get you have links from these authority publications, right? These personal sites, is all these people, right? But you also get traffic from them, and they have the incentive to share these articles as as much as they can, even LinkedIn, for example, because they get a commission out of it. Hopefully, this makes sense. Now, 
The second way is with listicles, right? Incentivizing people to write listicles. And it's in the same line, more or less, because uh, they all be affiliates, right? Just, I mean, you can have a solo review just like this one or this one. These are just solo reviews. Or you can have, actually, this one is alternatives, but this one is a solo review. But you can have articles like listicles, like, for example, like uh, Journalist AI um, Alternative, right? And these guys are, let's see here. Uh, I don't think we have one for alternative. I think it should be this one right here, right? This is an article, a listicle has all of these alternatives down here, right? This one, this one, this one, this one. And these guys don't put affiliate links on every one. Actually, no, they, don't even, they don't even link to the sites, which they should, but it's a listicle, right? It is a top 10 uh, tier in which you, we, they can add affiliate links in every single one of these ones, right? And the way in which you can produce this type of content is just by leveraging ChatGPT. And because it's connecting to the web, GPT-4, right, you can just ask it, um, let's say, for example, I'm an affiliate and I want to build a, 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 an article reviewing Journalist AI. I say like this, uh, go to tryjournalist.com and learn as much about the brand as you, as you can. Then write an in-depth article going over the pros, the cons, the competitors and how it's different and better, right? And there you go. You, you can just a prompt and play around with this. Um, and just hit send, right? It's going to write a whole article about it, but first going to be doing research, right? Now, if you want to make it a bit more uh, rankable, right? Because just something off of a, off a chat GPT won't rank, right? You want something that has like this, right? In article images that complement what the article is about, in article videos that again that are relevant to what the article is about, bullets, tables, quotes, internal links, external links, right? All this, right? Then properly done, not just a generic AI written or ChatGPT written content. And a way in which you, which you can do this quite easily is by actually, in this case, so going full circle here, here, sorry, is by using journalist AI, right? Which allows you to essentially, uh, if you go here to generate articles, and like ChatGPT, where it's just like a text box, here you have a lot more control over the input. Meaning with AI, of course, as you might know, the better the input, the better the output. And here you can select, for, do you want videos in the articles? You can select yes. You can even customize your own videos if you like. You can select if you want images in the articles, which type of images, stock photos, Google images, custom images, or even AI images. Uh, you can even select, right, in article image or featured image. You can set up the internal and external linking, right? So it does everything automatically for you, right? There's a couple of rules here, but if you just select this, right, when it writes the article for you, right, it's going to add links, right, in it. And they're going to link out to, for example, if this article is about finance, you're going to link out to uh, Wikipedia, maybe they're going to link out to um, Bloomberg, maybe Tank, TechCrunch, right? So they're going to link out, it'll scrape the internet for relevant articles in your niche language, very important language, and they're going to add them here automatically for you, right? There's a couple of rules you can do here. For example, if you don't want to link out to competitors and a bunch of stuff, you can do this as well. Internal linking, you just add in here your sitemap, right? This is more for a, a on SEO of or your own site. Uh, and you can have it so there's links right in the article linking out to other blog posts of yours, maybe to your homepage, maybe to other your contacts page, whatever, right? You can do this a, a really easily with this. You can set up the structure, right? If you want to add a call to action to the tool you're reviewing, you can enable disable all these sections. You can select the article length. Uh, you can even uh, enable and disable all these tables, quotes, bold words, give it a bit more uh, sauce, right? Give it a bit more, um, make it a bit more interesting, right? You can even connect this to the web, which is very, very important, right? If you want up-to-date information, you want to make sure that the articles that you're writing, right, if it, either if they're reviews or if they're top 10 listicles, you want to make sure that it's connected to the web, right? So it has the most up-to-date information, right? Uh, content, you can, of course, select the language you want and the target country, creativity levels, tone of voice, change your point of view, and in, up here in the generation mode, you can generate, generate the article, sorry, based on description styles or keywords. Now, this AI is pretty cool because it detects automatically if you're producing a listicle or not. So if I just go here and generate based on titles and say uh, top five AI writing tools for 2024 and then just do one for a journalist AI review, right? It's going to generate two articles, right? I'm just going to select English, select US, put high creativity, just put it in a voice to informal, change the point of view to first person, connect this to the web. Um, I'm going to enable all this. I'm going to enable all this. I'm going to enable, I'm just going to enable internal linking, just, but I'm going to enable external linking. I want images. I want stock photo images and I want them everywhere. So if I just generate two articles, right? Oh, let me just remove this right here. If I just generate two articles, the AI is going to know, right, that one of them, this one is a listicle, so it's going to generate a listicle type of article, and this one is not. So it's just going to generate a 
regular uh, review article review right so let me just wait for this to generate and we'll go over exactly what we should be doing next okay we're back minor technical problems the video recording broke but we're back again here I'm just gonna go to history and show you that uh, this is in fact working let me see this one right here because I did generate a couple more to show you that the AI knows the difference between a listicle in this case this one is a listicle and a non listicle right uh, so a listicle again as you see here uh, this one right top five AI writing tools right there's a table of contents that has all the writing tools if we click this here it's properly explained right what it is a link to the tool right this could be an affiliate link if we want a quick summary some quotes and a description right all it is for every single tool right it for some reason didn't add any images i think i don't i didn't say i don't think i saved the images but it does generate images as you see here just for example this is an article about how to groom a golden retriever this as in article images as you see here and these are uh, ai generated but based on a vector style type of images but you could play around with this you can even generate uh fully realistic images if you want right but again in article images in article links even in article videos as you see here that are relevant to what the content is about this again is a video about dog grooming and of course the article is about dog grooming and there's a bunch more here right and you can play around with this and then again just to show you that these articles work with in article images in article videos and all that done for you links and all that and the ai knows to um, distinguish between when you want a listicle or when you want just a review, right? And again, circling back to what I was saying before, this is a great way if you want a software business or a tool, right, to have and incentivize people to to build links to your tool is again, uh, as I was saying before, uh, review articles and also uh, listicles, right? And get them to write it for you. And you can even reach out to these uh, sites that aggregate tools, right, and send them the content ready for them to to uh, uh, post, right? Use Journalist AI to generate the content, then send them over. And again, it's a great way to uh, incentivize people to do so. Again, you have to, of course, have an affiliate program or something that incentivizes them to do so, because it's going to be a win-win on both sides. But again, a great way is, again, with uh, review articles or listicles. That's it. That's the video. Like, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.